Ah, tu non ho gioia. And lastly, our last group is what is the climate crisis? So if you are here and you are not so sure about what climate change is about, what the rest of the world is doing, what's the Paris Agreement, what is the IPCC and why do they keep releasing so many reports? You can go over there to the what is the climate crisis group to learn more. Over there we have um, a quiz game to quiz your climate knowledge and learn more about climate change and learn, a more, learn more about the important action that needs to be done. And lastly, okay, hi guys. So, welcome back to another episode of Jai's Fishing. Today we are here at uh, Pongo... Pongo what? Ah? Waterfront? Ah? Near the marina. Ah, near... near Waterfront. Basically the Pongo Marina. Then we walk further down. We walk quite far. So there's quite a lot of people around. Today is a... Uh, yeah, it's, it's filled. There's people everywhere. But good thing is the wind is very mild. The current... So pretty, it's yeah, it's quite dead. The water is quite dead. We just arrived here. Time now is about 12 plus 1. Yeah, I'm very tired. I don't know if I'll do a proper vlog for this. I'll try, lah, I'll try. But it's, it's honestly very tiring for us because we do have GoPro. We cannot just lock the stuff. If we want to, if we want to video, then we got to like actually take out our phone and film. Yeah, so it's quite, it's quite tough. Lah, and we are both pretty tired. So we'll probably fish until overnight lah, until daytime. Hopefully, yeah, first light lah. Hopefully we'll get something. So we'll update you guys later. Okay, so beating up the hook. So tall, yeah, with So this is a so Apollo rig with size it's four, four. Size four and size one hooks yeah. alternating. Size four, one side. Size one, four, size one, four, four, one, size four, one. Ah, four, yeah. one, four, so one, four, one, four, one, four all the way. Uh. So just take a piece of sotong. This is a cut kelong sotong. So just take it and hook, hook twice like if possible so that small yeah, fish won't take. I'm wearing gloves because them disgusting. I'm not <laughs> in. Yeah. So <laughs> one, two, three, four la. Yeah. Yeah, so we probably cast this out but cannot cast too far. Yeah, because the boy. Yeah. yeah. Oh, we're wrong. Never mind lah. Yeah, it's a bit near, but never mind. Yeah, so... Actually, this is our first time here lah, so we don't really know the... the this this area well, so... Then we realised that the boy ah, out there is actually... It's actually so near. The boy, there's one whole line of boy. Yeah, so... We brought out our surf casting 15 feet, 12 feet, but... <laughs> No point because we also can't cast far, so we just lightly, lightly casting the rod on here. Yeah. Second cast, the first one wrap around. Yeah, no one, no one, Jeff. Yeah. Okay. Not bad, lah. Yeah, fish. Oh, yes, it's a fish. What is this? Uh, usat. Usat. This is usat. Usat. Ah, usat. Wow. This is a big usat. Wow, this one must careful. Eh, you have to Wow. 
due to catfish. So I think it's the common thing about all marine catfish is that they have venomous uh, spines. Uh. This one is the same, no different. It's on top here. It's covered by the fin, uh, but it's right here. Uh, so this is quite big for an usat. Because usat, usually you, the ones you see is like that. Uh, in Singapore, you don't really see like that. Mm. Slightly different, toss up, it's black black one. Uh, this was on Katsu Tong, four hook, my four hook Apollo. Here's the rig we are using for our soft caster. So basically, it's a double Apollo. I just coil it up and put nicely up. Then this is a size six. This is a size six uh, sinker. Yeah, normal one, uh, not the soft casting. I just a normal sinker. Okay, so I'll take out this. So I think this is a good way lah to keep the rig. Right, you just go in and out, in and out a few times with the hooks. So you just like read through. Then when you see it reaches this point, then you can just hold it and open. So this is a double Apollo. Yeah. Size one zero. Yeah, this is one zero. Don't have the fancy full T knot lah, but yeah, works lah. Okay, I'm gonna tie myself man. And I don't have a lot of time to tie up. Yeah. So we roll here. I just pull it through. Okay, it works ah. Sometimes, sometimes I will fray this thing a little bit in places with a lot of sunkot. So in case this sinker goes inside the sunkot, I pull this one break. Yeah, in other ways, you can use thread and tie your sinker onto it. Uh. Yeah, or like just tie 5 pound line or oh, something. Oh yeah, 5 pound line or something. A lot of ways. Uh. So basically what we do is, we tie this one. Yeah, 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 Okay. Okay. Uh, behind here, turning around, and go back. But for like most of the time, the small fishes will bite off the. Uh, yeah, the head, head all that lah. Okay, yeah, my no choice. Okay, so there was one. Let's do the other. One. Again, you have to be very careful not to cross the boy because it's super near. <laughs> yeah, baiting up another hook. It's a two zero Apollo also. Yeah. Be bright though. Be bright. Yeah. Very damn. Especially for places like this, you need to watch out for behind because it's a walkway. Yeah, so if anyone goes by, then behind go very fast, uh. and it's very very close up. Uh. So when casting. 
thing just like that. Careful. Why to hold the line, it's not a rope, what about it? Yeah, must hold the line. Or else you will cross the boy. There is never coming back. Yeah. We'll just wait and hope for the best. Small fish lah, small fish. Small fish lah, that one. Hold on something. Jahan is it? Gao. Oh, Gao. Yeah. Gaba. Grouper. Should I pull up for you or you want to just? I think you want me to pull up. No, I just hold my rock. I go back and take it. It's actually quite big. Do you want to just hit? Okay, I'll stand up. Size on your spot. Yeah, size on your spot. Oh, this one took pretty fast. Uh. I think it was there for a bit. Uh. Yes. Like, yeah, but hook just by the side. Uh. You're okay, damn lucky. Uh. I think next time we need to guff. Yeah, next time we need to guff it. Yeah. yeah. Alright, bring the fish. Oh, blue spot, blue spot. I thought it's a crab. It's a blue spot, really. Oh my gosh. But you gotta have some line, right? The time now is 2.30ish, 2.30 plus ah. and So far, CR is one orange spotted grouper, Epinephalus coriolis And one uh, blue, blue spotted fentail ray, yeah, he lim, limna yeah. So okay, I guess pretty decent ah, for any night We will still continue fishing, probably until first light I guess yeah, since now the fish are biting, I think we should uh. The wind has totally died down, completely stopped Now it's very very calm I don't even... I can't even hear the waves moving uh. 
So I think the water is just yeah completely dead. So anyway, we'll carry on and update you guys later. Okay, on to something. Oh, another one. What is it? Blue, Blue spot. Can uh. bring up. Wait, wait, I help, I help you. Oh, can. Uh. Oh, this one even smaller. Oh my gosh. Something on. Wow, wow, wow. Whoa, 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 whoa. Oh my goodness. <laughs> it's a big ass dosa. Careful, man. You don't eat now, this one? I honestly don't. I saw. Can you put it back? Spotted rib ray and uh, blue spotted oh, fan tail ray. Yeah. Decent size. Eh? Yeah, this one. Alright guys, time now is 4.30 About there, 4.30 eh? 13, yeah, 13, sorry, not 13 Okay, so our rod's still up So far, it's been, there's been quite a bit of action, I guess Ray lah, small rays uh, Two blue spot One small mangrove wheat ray And oh dear, there's a crab on this I don't know how well you can see it, but there is, yeah, it's moving ah, so I think it's a crab ah, probably cannot hook it, never mind, I'll let it eat Yeah, there's been 
a small mangrove whip ray, one small white spot stingray, two blue spot fentail ray, one tossat, big tossat, one usat, and one orange spotted grouper. Gao. Yep. So I think it's a pretty interesting day. Uh. We tried catching crabs. We tried to attract sotong with the light. I dropped like a few sotong, but yeah, never mind lah. Uh. Okay, yeah. Yeah, so we're currently fishing. Hopefully, that won't be the end of our sea. Uh. So we'll update you guys later. On, on to something. On to something. Not sure what. But something. Oh, what is that? Kachi. Oh, interesting. Hey, I tried it. You, you just take it. Oh, yeah, you're like, you're strong. Was it always like. oh, there? Yeah. Yes. at Pongo waterfront time now is about 7 7 something uh, I also don't know yeah. so we're both very tired it was a pretty good session the total sea was 1 orange spot 2 blue spot stingray 1 mangrove whip ray 1 white spotted whip ray uh, one big tossat, one kaji, and I think two or three of the usat. Yeah, so after that, the bike just uh, kind of shut down because it was peak low tide. Yeah, yeah so okay, la, it was a decent session, I guess. So thanks for watching. See you guys in the next episode. Yeah.